Who is following your LinkedIn company page and how can you find out the names of the people following? So my name is Louise Brogan. I'm the host of LinkedIn with Louise and you're very welcome to this channel where I teach you how to use LinkedIn for business. So we're on the LinkedIn company page. So that's opposite, that is not your personal profile, it's your company page. And we're looking at it from the super admin view, you can see here. To view as member, you click on here, but I am in as an admin on the back end of my company page. So here's the company page, here's the followers here, and up here we're looking at the tab that says analytics. So click on analytics, and we're looking specifically for our followers. So click on followers, and you can see that it says it has a different schedules here so you can have last 365 days 90 days 30 days last two weeks or a custom date so who is actually following my page who are these 1152 followers if we scroll down to the bottom of this page you can see the demographics um, and you can change that by company size you can change that by the industry the person is in let's scroll down further and here it says all followers. So I can see specifically the people who are following my company page here. And to see all of the followers, you just want to click on see all followers and you literally, you can scroll down and see all of those people who are following your company page. Now that is a little bit um, of a wade through who's all following your page. Can you actually download those names? Well, no, you can't. Excluded from your report. So what report are they talking about? So what you can do is you can export your follower analytics, but not by name. And I'll just show you how to do this. I'm just gonna look at November, 2022. I'm going to over here, I'm gonna click on export. And it says it'll be exported as an XLS file, time range, check. Yes, I'm gonna click on export. I'm going to show you exactly what that looks like. So very quick, here is because it's only a month's worth of followers. So let's open this Excel spreadsheet out. And here it is. So we've got um, the date that people followed. And you might think, well, what, what was this date? The 19th of November, I had five followers. So what happened on that day? Um, but let's look at where are they from? So what location are they from? And this is already set from high to low. And uh, then what job function are they in? So the majority of my followers, as you can see here, are, let's just zoom in a little bit for you, business development and then media and communications. Seniority level, again, let's zoom in a tiny bit. Senior entry level, director, owner, C-suite. So that's really interesting. Who are you trying to actually reach with your company page? Um, what industry are they in? Again, zooming in a little bit. Professional training and coaching, advertising services, business consultancy. So um, one of my goals is to grow our network of people working in law firms. So I want to do this number to increase. And then what company size? So let's have a look here. You can see that um, the biggest size for me is the small business area, which is really... Um, the audience that I talk to a lot. So that is the information you can export from um, from LinkedIn and you can, of course, oops, let's just zip that away and um, keep that and keep track of it. You can't fault, you can't keep the names. What you can do, I suppose, is pull the names from here. Um, so for example, this lady here, Courtney, is a third level connection of mine, so I might want to connect with her. Um, Marianne is Director of Engagement Development. Um, I want to find out more about her, so I click through to that person, find out more about them. So follower analytics, that's how you get them from your company page. Any questions, pop them down below and remember to subscribe to the channel.